Hey guys, so here's the thing. I'm planning on launching my own business and uh, something's wrong here. There, much better. I guess I don't need a suit anymore. So here's the thing. I'm gonna be launching my own business and that can sometimes be isolating. So I thought what would be a funner way to share this experience than to document it happening every step of the way so that one day I can look back and see how this all happened, what mistakes I made, but more importantly, I get to share that experience with you and I'm hoping that we can all learn together how fun and how difficult launching a business can be. working out right now it's a great time to be an entrepreneur in Halifax a lot of resources a lot of people are out there being mentors and we're all trying to grow this thing together as well as my venture is going to be related to the mental health field and I think we're finally to the point where we're starting to open up about um, how many of us and how many of our loved ones are suffering and unfortunately I, I don't feel like I have the power to change the system. It's a government slash bureaucracy that is just so slow to change. So I'm going to try to take an entrepreneurial approach and I'll be sharing my plans later. But first, let's make this official. So, looking good, huh? Uh, got one more thing to do though. Wait one second. So one of the biggest pieces of the puzzle uh, with starting my own business is if I'm going to be starting this platform and revenue is months away, how am I going to pay the bills? So I'm going over to Job Junction here. Um, I read that they may have a program for entrepreneurs such as myself. So, I'm gonna be going for the meeting and uh, hopefully it goes well. I'll let you guys know what I learned. So, I'm just heading to a fusion event. Just time for a quick update. Um, came back from the job junction meeting with the case manager and essentially how it's gonna work is I'm gonna go to a orientation put on by seed and I guess take it from there see what my next steps are but if everything works out there may be an opportunity for me to uh, actually get employment insurance benefits for a maximum of up to 40 weeks so if I can make that happen that would be amazing and would probably make the viability of this whole thing a lot more possible so that's the update for now 
See you later. Okay, I just realized that I totally forgot something. Another reason why I wanted to create this vlog is that I wanted a reason to challenge myself and to put myself in uncomfortable situations. So, in every episode of this vlog, I will be facing one of my fears. Not only that, but I will be letting you know where on my fear hierarchy that falls. For example, if I need to give an accepted speech at St. Mary's University, um, that's probably like an 8 or 9 out of 10 on my fear hierarchy. If I am jumping off a cliff, then I'll show you what that is. Either way, every single episode, I will force myself to face a fear. And you will be able to see it happen. So, until then, see you next episode.